so this is the other side of the beach. Uh, actually, we came from right there. And now we are on top of the hill. And as you can see, let me show you something. Uh, there's a golf course uh, right there. It's not really a course. It's, uh, you just want to, you know, check out your swing. You can do it right there. Back behind me, right here, are actual hotel rooms. Uh, these cost about $150, U.S. dollars, as of, you know, today's date, uh, the 2010. Uh, you could uh, avail of full amenities when you're up here. We uh, give you that's not faux brick that's actually bricks those are actually bricks now let me turn you guys around as you can see right there a pool we got some ATV down there if you want to check out your ATV skills and explore the area a little bit more there's another building for another wing for uh, hotel rooms and there's actually another one so there's one right here and there's actually another one right there. All right. So, from what I was told, uh, this place was built in the probably 80s. I'm not too sure. I, I should have I should have done my research before I took this video. We actually uh, came here on a on a moment's notice. Uh, not thinking that we were actually going this far north. So this is the walkway. See how pretty that is? That's gorgeous. Nice green grass. Some water uh, The pool's actually nice and clean and crystal-like. Back there, if you look, see where my finger's pointing right there? That's actually uh, part of the forest. It's very pretty. You see up there, they're probably doing some renovation. And this is a typical uh, patio for your room. Very gorgeous. Very homey, very... Uh, very there are many, many, many uh, world and uh, world dignitaries and presidents that came through here uh, and, and the market that actually entertained them in this uh, location. If you ask me, the Marcos has probably built this area specifically just for that purpose is to entertain people, entertain uh, dignitaries from around the world. Now let's swing around this area. Look at this courtyard. Isn't that gorgeous? See all the palm trees? Coconut trees, actually. Gorgeous, gorgeous area. Look at this. Let's go swing around here. They actually have a sanct an animal sanctuary right there, right where my finger's, uh, finger's uh, pointing. You can see there's an animal sanctuary. That's the uh, renovation I was talking to you about. So maybe, maybe just some repairs. Uh, looks like they're replacing the uh, wood slats right there. Very nice area. The fountain, from what I was told, is under repair. Very gorgeous place. Uh, let's go through here. There's a walk, a walkway, right over here, and it actually leads into the main uh, lobby uh, reception. So if you look right here, there actually is a reception, a shopping arcade, cafe, ballroom, casino, uh, bar, an Asian restaurant, and an airline reservation. Coming down this way. Oh, 
We actually have a hotel, hotel rooms, a rec center, a driving range, gym, and hot sand. So we're heading our way to the uh, main lobby. You know, uh, this place is, is, is really gorgeous. Uh, it has a lot of potential. I would imagine that back in its heyday, uh, this this place was flowing with people. It's just that uh, right now, because of maybe the economy, maybe because maybe because of uh, a, a bad um, publicity, I should say, uh, uh, patronage has has has, has dipped quite, quite low. Uh, you have very, very few people that come through here now. Uh, I'm surprised it's actually is still open. Uh, hopefully they revive this place. It has a really, really great potential. Alright, so this is for now, and I'll check you guys out later.